Hi everyone, my name is Roland. I've been skating for two months and I got my ollie down. I just want my ollie to jump while moving. I need your support. Thank you. Awesome, man. So thanks a lot for sending in your video. I really, really do appreciate it. I think you have the best talking section out of any skate support I've ever seen. Like, rolling on the skateboard on the stomach. Cool. This is a thing that I get a lot of requests about. How to ollie while moving. It's like you learn to ollie while still, but then you want to put it together while moving. Thanks for your support. Thank you. And it's a little bit harder to work out. Cool. So let's see what we got here. Pop. Drag. Boom, landed. That was interesting because you're moving, just moving very slow, and then you did the ollie that almost stopped. So you just need a little more speed. Let's see here. Drag your front foot up. Cool. So both of those are ollies, and they were good. We can definitely improve upon a few things, and I'm going to cover all of those. The main thing that I always like to tell people when they say, I can do this trick, but I can't do it while moving, I always say, well, how good are you at just riding? Can you ride around everywhere? Can you turn? Can you stop? Can you do a little power slide? Can you turn in both directions? Can you turn while lifting up your front truck? Are you very comfortable riding your board? Because if you're really comfortable riding your board and you can pop your board and make it do a trick while you're just on flat, then you can definitely just add a little speed to that. It shouldn't be too much different, honestly. But in order to make that a correct statement, you have to be very good at riding your board. So if you can do an ollie standing still, but you can't do it while moving, it generally indicates to me that you're not that great at just riding your board around, and that's the prior step that you missed. There's generally a prior point that you didn't fully have in that is kind of holding you back from putting the full thing together. And in this sense of you learning to ollie while moving, I would say just riding your board around everywhere, ride it to the store, ride it to school, ride it to school, ride it to school, because it's probably where you go the most is school. If you ride it every day to school, I bet you're going to get your ollie down while moving super fast. Um, so yeah, it's also just a point of practice. Now the other thing, just in terms of improving your ollie period in general, in general period, general, 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 is after you drag your front foot up, you have to push it out in front of you. That step is super, super important. And it really shows on that slow motion shot of Doug alling over that desk, because it almost looks like he's going to clip the desk, but then his front foot pushes forward, and it miraculously lifts his back wheels up into the air higher. And it's that motion of pushing his front foot forward while simultaneously bringing his back foot up into the air. Well, here, I'll show it to you right here in the slow motion. So pop the back foot. Now watch me drag my front foot up. This is about where you stop right there, and then you start pushing down. But you can actually keep your front foot going up, and then... Watch, I start to push my front foot forward at the same time as bringing my back foot up into the air. And then once it's high and pretty level, then I start putting the landing gear down right about here. Boom, that's the sickest right there. And now I'm starting to put the landing gear down. By landing gear, that's like when a plane is landing and then they put the wheels down. That's what I mean by landing gear. In this sense, it's my legs. My legs in the wheels. <laughs> so then you put your, your feet down and then land and roll away. So yeah, make sure you have that prior step of learning to ride your board down really well and then learn to ollie and put those together. You got it, man. Cool, so thanks a lot for your guys' support. Definitely check out Skateboarding Made Simple Volume 1. It is extremely detailed, and it gives you steps to practice at every step of the way. So you're not just like, 
here's how you do the trick. Pop it, flip it, catch it, land it. No, you have specific things to practice, not just practicing the full trick.